this video, we are going to be visiting the Angel Oak Tree. The Angel Oak Tree is located on Johns Island, South Carolina, and is one of the oldest surviving oak trees on the East Coast. If you didn't know the uh, location of this tree, you would drive right past it. We are headed right now down a very dirt road right off of Maybank Highway. And uh, look at this, this road isn't even paved. Time travel is possible. Welcome back dudes and dudes. Thanks for coming back to my channel. Today, we are here in Charleston going to a local gym. This is the Angel Oak Tree. Uh, we're about to go inside and um, should be a really good time. Really, uh, really fun. Go ahead. Yeah, it's going this way. <laughs> Enjoy. This tree has been saved for the public's enjoyment. And uh, let's go inside and check it out. If you're new here, hit that subscribe button. And if you enjoy this, please, it helps us out, hit that thumbs up. Without further ado, let's go inside and check out the oak tree. Uh, this is pet friendly, so I do have Ellie with me, but because certain areas around the tree, they don't allow the pets. Anyway, she's hanging out in the air conditioning and uh, this is gonna be a quick quick visit we're gonna take a look at this tree and um, we'll learn a little bit about it pretty awesome it's about 15 to 20 minutes away from downtown Charleston on Johns Island South Carolina this is a hidden gem if you're in town and you want to try something off the beaten path this is one of the places that you should be going to uh, this tree was gonna be knocked down and destroyed and people saved it and now it is a local legend attraction. Let's go. Okay, right when you come inside, there's a um, little gift shop here. It's got a lot of great local gems, some surprises, some rocking chairs out front, little uh, swinging chair out front, and some rocking chairs. They also have some restrooms here for men and women. Oh, so they must have uh, taken this out. Originally, you go through the gift shop, but as we know, you exit through the gift shop now. Some porta potties over here. And uh, like I said, there's some dogs there. So the dogs are allowed, but they're only allowed to the left, left of this area. So, see here. Um, but if you do want to bring your dog, it is pet friendly. You just have to keep them away from the tree. There are a lot of areas here in the shade of all these trees here. A lot of places to sit. If it's uh, hot in the summertime, you can definitely come and sit here. Um, but I'm going to do a reveal now and you can take a look at the angel oak. Like I'm floating through the air The pain I felt is paid for All is said and done This tree is massive It has a 25 and a half foot diameter And the area underneath the trees that's in the shade is 17,000 feet. Look at this thing. 
it is enormous and being here and seeing it there's even like a whole ecosystem growing on top of the tree there's some leaves and moss it's it is just majestic and actually actually we're gonna see here in a minute that the branches are so long that they're actually grown onto and under the ground. I mean, it is amazing. I mean, this spirit is, is so grand and has been here for so long. She just wants to rest her weary limbs on the ground. I am as old as old can be. I'm estimated to be 400 years old. You see, I've got to be very attractive because the surveillance on me is active. My limbs are hollowed, but you can't tell because my bark is what keeps me looking well. I don't look like when you lean, pull, sit, stand, or climb on me. Also, your purses, cameras, or anything that would danger me. I ask that you just admire and let me be. Look at the tree, just like under the ground here. And then it comes back out of the ground and comes back over here. And then she rests her weary limbs on the soft earth. Really, really wonder. That's just what goes through my head here. Look over here, there's some more. We're gonna politely go around here. We're way out here at the end of the tree. And um, you can just look that way and see all of her limbs resting because she's so old. It is just, it's just spectacular. I mean, if trees could talk, they'd tell a story of time. Time that we can't, as humans, experience. Look at this. And it's such a hot day, it's like 90 degrees out. But underneath her leaves, it's very, it's just very um, nice and cool. certainly beautiful from every angle and uh, in the summer when you get a lot of rain you get this kind of plant life there that just makes her shine I was saying earlier that there um, there are posts that actually hold the brains up so that the weight doesn't collapse the branch and and hurt her we want it to live as long as possible. So you can see here, there's a post. There's another post here. And then a huge post, kind of like a telephone pole holding her up right here for the stress points. And then there's another one here, right there.
we're here underneath the uh, main part of it near the trunk. And uh, based on the website, it says it's um, 25.5 feet in diameter. Let's see how wide it is if I walk around. It's actually quite busy today. I've never seen it this busy, but um, years ago when I came, it was more towards the winter time. So if you want to come when it's less busy, just go ahead and come in the fall or winter, or early spring. This is peak season right now. So that's her. That is the angel oak. Highly recommend. Hope you enjoyed this tour. We're gonna go in and check out the gift shop. But for now, just take a look at this. Just gorgeous. This also kind of harkens back to a different time when you pull off of Main Road. You can get to it from Main Road, Johns Island, or Maybank Highway. When you pull off the road, it's actually a dirt road. And uh, these, these days, with all the crazy that we're dealing with, it's almost nice to go back in time a little bit. But uh, 400 years, this thing was just a little sapling when, uh, when our country was born. Probably like just getting its roots in the ground. Pretty amazing. Explorers were all up and down the East Coast. And this tree was just digging its roots right into the ground to be here for a long time. And um, the organization that keeps this thing going, they want it to live to 900. So hopefully they can do that. It'll be way after our lifetime that this tree continues to grow. Pretty sweet gift shop here as well. They have a lot of local treats here. I did not like the recording, so I just took a couple clips and uh, I exited the gift shop. I'm trying to spread the love, but not everybody loves it. They have local teas, treats, plates, books, clothes, things like that. Thank you. Perhaps someday this tree right here, maybe even trees around it, will be just as big as this one. And as they say, the apple doesn't fall far from the tree. Pretty beautiful. And that's all she wrote. Awesome, quick. If, you've, if you're in the uh, area, this is a not to miss. Nice and cool in here, Ellie. I wish you could have come. I wish you could have come with us. I saw some puppies in there, but you wouldn't be able to get close to the tree. So maybe next time you can look at it. It's pretty. Go look. What is that? Is that a big tree? Wow. So nice. Thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next one. Bye dudes.